And this Commodore 64 video, I'm going to show you how to format a Commodore 64 floppy disk on a PC. This is the way I do it. But, I already have a video on how to format these. I showed like, what, four or five ways. The easiest ways if you, on a Commodore 64 is if you have any kind of fast load cartridge, use that. Some of them are as fast as like 20 or 30 seconds. So you got your fast load, hit that little pound, go to C to copy, go to F to format, and format your disk. That takes pretty long also. Open one, comma eight, comma fifteen, comma C and colon. This name, comma this ID, I use like A1 for side one. Colon. And then we gotta close this. And that's how you format the disk in the old fashioned way. Let's see how long this takes. There you go. It took um, just a minute 18. Okay, now to format the floppy from your PC, you're gonna need a zoom floppy. This plugs in through with a USB drive. Typical 1541 cable. Stick the disk in the drive. And we gotta drop to a DOS command. So this is what I use to format anything that's already been used. Because we want to check, we want to format the disk and also check for errors. This is, uh, this is drive D, change disk to open. Yeah. And there's a program here called CBM. There you go. Anyway, so this is a format program. And the command line we're going to use, we're going to, um, and I want to use C. I want to clear the disk. Check this out. Clear the disk. We want to clear the disk, demagnetize the disk. This is great for the when the disk is used. And then we want to verify each track. If we get any errors, we'll throw the disk away. Also, we want to put in the original over here. Oh, we're going to use the V code to verify, which you need on a used disk. And also, O to set it back to original pattern. So let's type that in. I already got the C in. We're going to clear the disk. We're going to verify the disk. We're going to set it back to original. And now we're going to need a name. Let's type that new comma. Oh wait. We got to put the we got to put the drive letter in. Eight. Now we go name comma a one hit return. Done. 24 seconds. And you get this nice status report. Check this out. See here? It had to um, retry track one twice. That means it didn't pass the verify, more than likely. Had it re had to write track six twice. And then at the bottom, it made it to track 35. It is done. Now, it is safe to use this disc. So I think that's the best option to format a used disc. Oh, uh, one day this week I was doing this, I threw away probably 40 or 50% of the used disc. They just wouldn't format with, um, with the Verify. They had errors that it couldn't get past, so I'm not gonna use those. I'm gonna throw those away, and all you need is a Zoom Floppy. A zoom Floppy is not very much money. If you're serious in a Commodore 64, I've had that Zoom Floppy. I've had the Zoom Floppy for over 10 years, I think. It's still working. I use it all the time. Alright guys, post below if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. I should wear a hat.